Welcome back. With today we are speaking with Dr. Barth Riedel, an orthopedic surgeon here at the Loma Linda University Medical Center. And if you've got a problem with your arms, from your shoulders, down to your hands, you're the man who uh, you might likely be dealing with here. You deal a lot with rheum people with rheumatoid arthritis, carpal tunnel syndrome, other hand conditions. Okay. What are signs that, that people need to, to seek medical care, perhaps even surgery? Well, most often the biggest thing is pain, but if you're having pain, numbness, or decreased range of motion that's just affecting your normal everyday activity, mm -hmm. that's probably something you should get checked out and see what we can do for you. Hand surgery, it seems like it's pretty, I would think it's pretty serious. Yeah. Anytime you have to do surgery, it's serious, but with your hands, it's, that's your whole functionality, being able to, to do things in life. Not something to be taken lightly. Right, I mean, you use your hands for everyday use, and the more um, deficit you get, and when you're using your hand or the more pain you get, you actually realize how much you do use it and how much you need it. So yeah, um, sometimes it's nice to see somebody who deals just with the hand specifically. As far as surgery goes, what are the more common types of, of surgeries that people come in seeking, seeking help for? Um, a lot of people get problems with arthritis. And as you get older, you just use your hands more and they wear out. And so arthritic pain in the hand and wrist is very common. Um, carpal tunnel, numbness, people waking up in the middle of the night can't feel their hand. Uh, it's also pretty common. Um, things like Dupuytren's, where their hand slowly kind of curls in and they can't straighten their fingers out. Actually really common. Um, but there's actually really good and new techniques we can use to treat these things, so. What are some of the things that are, that these new techniques that are, uh, that people may have seen a doctor years ago, but medicine's advanced a lot? Um, for arthritis, there's just uh, better ways to fix things. Um, there's newer tricks, there's newer implants we can use. Um, there's replacements for joints. Um, there's also things, um, different types of releases. Um, and uh, arthroscopic techniques, so smaller holes using a scope uh, to fix the problem rather than a big incision. Um, and there's a couple other minimally invasive techniques on certain things we can use. So scars are smaller and function is usually better. Yeah, I'm reading here, in fact, that you have, uh, it's not all just about functionality, that there are, I guess you can uh, have techniques to improve the, the appearance mm -hmm. of, of hands. How, yeah. does, how does that work? Well, the way we do the surgeries now, especially with the closure, um, you can close the skin without sutures. Um, we can use glue. Um, there's other techniques to decrease the size, straighten things out. Um, and in this society specifically now, it's not just about function, you're right. It's a lot of it is about cosmesis, uh, making the scar as small as possible, and just improving the overall look of the hand. That's fascinating. The Loma Linda University Orthopedic Surgery, uh, you have a plan of care for patients. How is that different, and how does that help people recover from hand pain. Yeah, well with hand specifically, surgery is only half the battle. The second half is the rehab afterwards to get your range of motion back. Um, and we work very closely with our occupational therapy department. So you come see us, we can do a surgery, and then we can send you immediately to our therapist to actually start working on the range of motion and the recovery process. So the prognosis, if somebody has one of these concerns or an issue with their hands, the, the prognosis, you can do something. It's not like something you just have to live with. No, absolutely. And in fact, a lot of the surgeries in hand have been so well um, described and practiced that the outcomes are actually quite good. Um, it's not just, I'm going to go into surgery and be different. Um, yeah. You can actually get significantly better now with a lot of things. So don't just give up on your hands. If you've got these issues, or in, not, not just your hands, but your arms as well, mm -hmm. there is something you can do about Definitely. it. Definitely. Okay, if you want to find out more about this, uh, go online at lomalindaortho.org. That's lomalindaortho.org. Dr. Barth Riedel, uh, again, an orthopedic surgeon here at the Loma Linda University Medical Center. Thanks so much for joining us today. Thank you. Okay. Top stories coming up next. You're watching the Desert's News Leader. Come on, Coachella Valley. Show us how you say good morning, America.